Hi everyone, it's Deborah Kozowski and this is a Millionaire Woman Minute. Are you dabbling in a hobby hoping that it will become a business? Or are you serious about making it a business and doing the real work behind it? Are you serious about generating an income that is steady, continually growing and expanding? And so are you in your vision and your purpose for what you want to accomplish with your business. Who are you here to serve? Think about those things. But I'm going to give you three key things that you need to be doing if you truly want to be a business owner who is making a difference and getting the results that they need. One of the biggest things that you need to do is focus on your genius. What are the two to three things, even one thing, that you can focus on and be really good at Hone your skills so that you are a sought after expert in that area. You want to get good and great to be considered the best. So hone the skills, whether you are a speaker, an author, a coach, do what you do best and leave the other pieces to all the rest. You will be attracting people through your hard work, perseverance, and your skill level and expertise by just being good and great, getting to greatness in stretching who you are. Secondly, you need to be consistent. You need to be consistent with your actions, with your relationships. You need to continually follow up with people and be consistent in your actions. Let's say you have a blog and you blog once this month, maybe the next month, or you skip a month or two, you need to be out there consistently so people see you as a visible expert. There's nothing worse than going to somebody's website and seeing that they haven't been on there since 2009, updating and refreshing it. If you want people to take you and your business seriously about the results and the solution that you can offer them, you need to be doing the same with your own business. Lead by example. There is a leader in each one of us. And thirdly, you need to take time and attention and cultivate and nourish and nurture the relationships that exist in your life. Whether it be with your spouse, your children, your potential contacts, and the people you meet in networking events. Get to know them. Find out what motivates them, what makes them tick, and what ticks them off, as one of my coaches would say. You want to be at the heart of what matters to them. Perhaps you can send them an article or a referral based on what you know about their industry and what they need. So what I want you to do is think about what you're doing right now. What is the revenue you want to gain? So here's a bonus item for you all. If you want things to grow or change, you need to measure them. You need to track your numbers, that revenue. You know, if you don't know what's coming in and going out, it's not going to show you any positive income. You need to have systems in place where you can be measuring and seeing what's effective and what's not, what things need to be changing. There's a lot of things involved in running a business. So think about it. Are you in a hobby position or do you really want to make a lucrative income doing what you love and doing it well? If you have people sitting on the fence in your life or maybe yourself, review this video, send it and share it with others. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter and LinkedIn. I'd love to be connecting with you and engaging in the conversation. Let's go out and make a difference and live your life rich from the inside out. Go to www.themillionairewoman.com to stay in touch and find out more about free gifts, articles and ways that I can help you achieve the results you wish. Have a fabulous day.